Welcome to Indianapolis, Indiana and historic Hinkle Fieldhouse where the Butler Bulldogs host the Villanova Wildcats tonight on Fox Sports Go. Butler comes in with a record of 5 and 13. They try to slow down a red hot Villanova at 9 and 9. Their third straight Big East victory. They have been on an absolute roll and they finally get their first points of the night. Now Lewin in the paint, the pull up. That's good. So many shots. They got to look at second chance opportunities. So if they're missing missing shots, they got to get on the board. And they only have three offensive or four offensive rebounds right now to boards. Han out to Gadeka. Buries it from the baseline. That Villanova has sustained. Fighting for her own rebound, and she gets the and one. Alex Lewin. Puts in the long three-pointer at the top of the key. A mismatch on a shorter Bailey. Out to Gadeka. Yes, for three. Just to shoot it outside. Here's Grace Stant for three. Yes. Kayla Hodges whistled for the foul. Butler's first of the half. Another three-point attempt for Stant, and she gets it to go. And a three-pointer is good. Han, the pull up. You better believe it. Performance. Gadeka driving baseline, kick out, and Villanova takes the lead. Eight seconds to go in the game. No timeouts left for either team. Lewin to Han. The pull up three is good. Losing seconds on the side of the Butler Bulldogs. On the season. the ball. Three seconds remain. Lewin throws it up. Is it shooting? It is. Knowing when the foul is coming and tries to throw it up right when it counts. As we mentioned, the last time she went to the line, Lewin an above 80% free throw shooter. And she knocks down the front two. Butler will still have nearly three seconds on the clock to put up a shot. And Lewin's third is good. Tie ball game. Career high, she has 23 tonight. 29 is her high. Long three. The freshman, Grace Stamp, answers. Good. Double team coming. Kick out to Quinn. It's good. And now the quick foul, but they cannot get it. And that will end the ball game. It comes all the way down to the wire, 70 to 69, a massive comeback victory for the Villanova Wildcats at one point. Welcome to the Big East Digital Network in Cincinnati's Cintas Center. It's the midpoint of the Big East Conference season. The Villanova Wildcats visiting the Xavier Musketeers. Learning the body control for the Musketeers. Big presence inside. Good three off the right side for Alex Lewis. She connects at 30% from behind the arc. What makes the Villanova system so special is not necessarily what they do, but how they do it. And that three-point shot there by Han typifies exactly why the basket does. Good kick out. Three up and good for Chicot. Drive and kick. Drive, draw, and kick. That is inside. Open. And then close the door. Nina Ayeti. Well, three for Tucker's going to go. So the original piece of that set didn't work out. They find Tucker for a long three. That's a double team up top for Quinn. Wide open three goes for Megan Quinn. Smart call. We heard Coach Coretta from the bench. In the, in the Lewin with a layup and a good assist for Quinn. So a good day for Megan Quinn filling up the stack out of the year. The Big East knocks one down. 19 point lead for Villanova. Great shot by Jay Cott. And I do give Ian and for Xavier a lot of credit on that deep. Villanova leads it 67 42. Step aside, be back with more on the Big East Digital Net. Villanova moves to 11 and 9 overall. They're 6 and 3 in Big East play. Built a big hurdle today. The Musketeers couldn't quite clear it. And Villanova off to its fifth consecutive victory. 